These are my notes from today. Craziness. So it's nine o'clock Saturday, September 10th. I got Chipotle on the way. I just Postmates it. Postmated it. Um, so it's on its way right now. Did that to save a little bit of time because not much has gotten done today. I wanted to get more done, but went to bed a little late. I'm telling you, when Chipotle does nachos, they'll shut the game down. The key is they need some liquid cheese, some queso. Since I pretty much eat a plant-based diet, I'm allergic to dairy and all that shit. I propose that they make a vegan cheese. It would taste as good, if not better, as some sort of liquidy queso concoction. Let's pray that that happens. Everything I believe in was not possible five years ago. Anybody can get in the game and talk. All of these notes are from a little session I got to go to today that was a bonus uh, included in a product I recently purchased from Real Social Dynamics. And a uh, big shout out to RSD Luke. Um, it was really awesome just seeing how he runs the show and seeing the sort of stuff that they're putting out there in terms of social success um, and in terms of um, getting the results that you're wanting in dating, love, life, etc. So um, that was really cool and I had a lot of takeaways. So I'm um, going to digest those things and see where they go from there. Um, right now I have a few hours uh, to get a couple things done because I haven't gotten much done today. And then uh, gonna step out for the evening with some friends and uh, maybe I'll film a little bit while I'm out there too if I get the chance. I'm still getting in the habit of this because I want to show just what my life looks like and what I do um, to maintain it, to have fun with it. I'm making this to give you just some insight and I don't know where it's gonna go completely, but it's been fun so far. So uh, gonna get these things done, play with Elvis for a little bit because he was locked up all day and then uh, get the night going. So in terms of what I do uh, for money right now, in terms of my business and what that all looks like, uh, right now I do about three things. And I need to really figure out and shift some things around. One, I have a podcast agency. So I have a couple people that I help their small business to uh, run their podcast. And I'm blessed enough to have a few people help me out on that. So I have a bit of a team. So that's been cool. And that's taken a, a year and a half to get to where it's at. Um, it's had its ups and downs, but it's been very good to me. I also, if you haven't been to the site yet, and simple plug, uh, head to jeremymontoya.me. And uh, what I've been talking about uh, to this point has been mostly about starting a business online, the entrepreneurial lifestyle, my mentality of it, and just kind of sharing where I come from with it, um, and mainly helping people to create personal brands and create coaching brands and those sort of things. And so I've been steadily building um, that online and wanting to get it to a point that's on autopilot or as close to that or systematize and process process size because I'm absolutely obsessed with processes and, and systems. I run a program called Email Elite, which has also been a ton of fun and a, a huge learning experience. It's basically, you get a training every single month and we talk about one thing you can do right now to build your email list and to grow your business online, which is the key to running a successful brand. So that's been awesome to me loving what I do there. And then my last coaching student just finished up um, where I help people. It was a six month process to create their business online or create their main service and offering. And then turning that into um, a business, getting that set up and leaving their day job. Like that, that was my huge mission with it. Um, and what's been dope is one of my students um, wasn't working, but didn't have to go back to work because of what she was able to set up. Um, the other one just left Rhode Island and got to San Diego. So she left her comfortable, cozy job, started a, a video editing business and doing some crazy killer stuff. And now she's in San Diego. We like had her last coaching call and she had just got there. Like that sort of shit is inspiring. And so it's been fun to do that. The other thing I get to do is I help my mentor out in his business. And so I, I can't recommend that more than almost anything else if you want to figure out the shortcuts in the areas you want to grow in your business or your life or the, the kind of results you want to get. Find the people doing it at the highest level and read their books, uh, pay to be around them, listen to their podcasts, consume their content, immerse yourself in it. And if you can, hire them for coaching and buy their time. Do anything you can to be around people who are living the sort of life or that have the thing that you're trying to figure out dialed in. There's no faster shortcut to it. It, it can be as, as um, much as getting personal help from them or working for them or so, you know trying to add value to their lives or it can be reading a book or it can be listening to a podcast. It can be as simple as you make it, but if I can recommend one thing to do, if you're trying to figure out what that is or <laughs> if you've decided if you decided that you want to be an athlete, if you decided you want to be an entrepreneur, if you decided whatever it is that you wanted, decide on that or when you do figure it out, 
go and spend as much time around it and them as possible. And I think you'll find that your results will increase at a much faster rate than those around you. Now I'm just trying to figure out like what that next chapter looks like. Who am I here meant to serve? Uh, who am I and what makes me happy? And all I want to do is figure out a way to be me and to show up as me every single day in the world and that be enough financially. And that, and that be able, and that fuel my entire process. And I had small thoughts of this over the last few years, but I haven't gotten to a point where it all clicked and made sense for how it would look on a day-to-day -day basis. And I'm still figuring that out. And like, that's exactly why you're watching this and why I'm recording this right now. Cause I want to figure those things out. I want to figure out what that looks like. I feel like I'm here to help people with so much more and I'm noticing a need for help with what I'm currently learning right now. I wanna be able to go anywhere in the world and grow a social circle and to grow um, amazing relationships and to enhance the relationships I have and to make amazing ones from here on forward. So uh, today was a good day learning about that from the real social dynamics peeps. So that was dope. Um, and I just wanna show what it looks like in the moment and we can see what can come from it. Um, but I think a lot of people uh, will be able to relate to where I'm at. And instead of giving advice, and instead of coming from that perspective, you're just gonna see what it looks like. And you're just gonna get a feel for um, how that could look in your life. And we're gonna go from there.